Hi everyone. So I wanted this video to be a Hello World video. I have been promising that we would get to that point. And I made that video and it was 37 minutes long, which the whole point of breaking these things apart was so that nobody would have to watch such a long video. So that should be the next video. This video will explain the basic framework for a BIOS program to work. And we also will talk about registers and we'll talk about interrupts since those are the main three things that we will need to know about to do programming in the future. Also, I am pleased to present to you the sudo cpp github.io uh, website. So it's sudo cpp.github.io Currently, the only thing on here is BIOS programming. I plan on adding details of all of my series that I have running. And in here, there's going to be a follow along guide for um, setting up the display, which we actually basically are talking about today. Uh, displaying text. Um, it has details or it will have more details on the actual uh, x86 processor. Uh, details that we're working with in general with assembly and then also some bio specific things such as um, the video services which we'll actually be dealing with today with uh, the interrupts that we're using so let's get to it for a BIOS program to work we need to have this we need to be in 16-bit real mode we need to have our origin point to 7C00. We need to have um, padding of 510 something, anything. What this basically says is however many bytes I'm filling up, um, subtract that from 510 and fill the rest with zero so that the 511th and 512th bytes are filled with AA and 5.5. Yep, that summarizes that. Okay, perfect. So now we can talk about registers and interrupts. Registers are basically, um, I feel like I've talked about this before, but they're basically like global variables in the processor itself. They're reused over and over and over, and any other process can change them so that they will um, remain being set. So if you call a process that sets AL for you, then the next time you call a different process, as long as you don't change AL, it's already set for you, which saves a lot of time of having to rewrite values and um, store them out the RAM and pull them back out of RAM and things like that. Um, a register will generally have an X after it. So AX, BX, CX, DX, those are the general purpose ones we have to work with. There's a high byte and a low byte, which means that AH is the high end and AL is the low end. So these are two byte registers. They each hold a word. If we set it, AX to 3, what that's doing is it's setting AH all to zeros and AL will be set to 3, just like um, you can imagine it as, let's see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, like that. This is basically what we're doing is we're setting all of these just to 3, so this would be AL, this would be AH. Um, the reason we're doing that is interrupts. So the video service interrupt is 10H. And if we look at our new little website that's currently under development, you can see for video services 10H or 0x10, they are the same thing, is how you call a video service. Now the way this works is when you say uh, interrupt 10H, it basically pokes the BIOS hands in an envelope saying, I want you to do something related to video services. And it will open that envelope up and say, okay, let's see, AH is zero, which means set the video mode. 
And when it opens that up, it says, all right, let's look at AL and find out which mode you want to use. And these are the different modes that we have available for us. And we said mode three, which gives us 80 by 25 characters. It is text and we have 16 colors to work with. Eventually this address will be populated. I had it populated, but I took it out because I want to make sure I give you the right information before it's permanently embedded in YouTube for the rest of human history. Um, and we'll begin that anyway, writing directly to the memory. Right now we're going to use BIOS calls because why not? So, um, moral of the story is um, we have our basic framework here so that the BIOS program works. We're setting the register to three. So AH is zero, AL is three. So the high bit is zero, the low bit is three. The reason for that is zero in the high bit means set the video mode. Three means set it to mode three, which we just looked at at the table. All right, so this was a short video, but it allows us to get into the hello world video without having to explain registers, without having to explain interrupts, without having to explain the framework. Um, it also introduces the website, which I will try to constantly update and make it look prettier and better. Um, it will also only cover the things that we're talking about. Um, so it's not gonna be an all-inclusive, complete resource on every possible nook and cranny of everything you can do. The reason for that is it's kind of like word problems. If you give the half the word problem is figuring out what the information is that's not applicable. When Susie and Johnny are walking in the field and they're looking at the sky and you need to tell them how many apples account and you're wondering why did you mention the sky? Why are they in a the field? Um, all this other stuff, it's just periphery. It doesn't really benefit what we're looking at. So. I'm going to narrow it down to just the things that we care about. And obviously as we move forward, there'll be more and more things. So that list will grow. So if you're an early subscriber, this is going to be probably more beneficial for you. However, uh, at the end point, we won't be, we won't have lists of information with all the stuff that you'll probably never touch in your life. Um, or even if you do, plan on touching it there's no details about it because we haven't talked about it so my goal is to try to make it easy and simple for you guys I hope you found this video useful my goal is to keep it short we look forward to seeing you in the next video when we can finally say hello world on the screen and we will see you then